All right, so here's what me and Jenny got going on tonight. We, I'm back here at our, where we throw knives at, our little camping spot in our woods, and we've been having trouble with these ground squirrels chewing up like our lawn chairs, and they've been chewed like we've got some extension cords running back here, and they're just starting to chew on everything, that and the mice. So I was watching this video the other day of how to catch critters that live in the ground, and what you do is you take one of these jugs right here, fill it halfway full of water, and you dump it down their hole, and you know it floods them out, they freak out, and they come shooting up out of the hole into this jug. And then you can release them somewhere else. You know, it's kind of like a live trapping with uh, with water, and you get like instant results. If they're home, if they're in the burrow, they're gonna come out. Because from what I've read, these ground squirrels only have one, just like one hole to their burrow, that's it. When it starts raining, they come out and go up in a tree or whatever. So uh, here's the hole. Right there, it's about almost the size of a baseball. I, I know it's a ground squirrel hole because I've seen it coming out, in and out of the hole. I mowed back here yesterday and I took a big uh, chunk of grass and shoved down in the hole to see if it was active. And when I come back here today and checked it, the grass was missing. So, so I know that there's a ground squirrel in here. So I'm gonna get Jenny to tip this jug over and then we're going to see what comes out of it. All right, I got Jenny over here finally. She's over to mess around with something. I was videotaping some ants. <laughs> okay. She's going to dump this jug down in here and we're going to see what happens. All right, go ahead, babe. Uh, he should come swimming up out of here pretty soon if there's anything in there because he's he'll be freaking out mm -hmm. that is a deep hole because <laughs> It took about three gallons of water. Leave it on there. I'll go throw another bucket up there. No, nah, Bab, if he was in there, he'd come out. Let's try it again another day. All right, well, he wasn't home tonight, but we're going to keep trying. We're going to get this critter. Keep enough on the chicken. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>